Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the shed. I am Lonnie. It is Tuesday. Candace is doing well. Uh, she's still recuperating from her surgery. Uh, everything is going just fine. Hopefully in a, a day or two, she'll be able to make a, an appearance on camera for just a little bit. But yeah, she is doing well. Um, we had a good sales day yesterday. I think we sold a little over $800, which is a high day for us lately, for sure. Um, let's go ahead and pull some orders because I need to go ahead and get this stuff out because I'm going to have to go to UPS store. I'm going to probably run to Goodwill today to drop some stuff off from the garage sale we had last week. And then uh, I may be running to storage to go find some more stuff to list. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. 10 Charlie. We sold a... Um, sorry here. I think it's over here somewhere. We sold a um, Snap-on Tools tool tray. It goes with the die-cast tool chest. E, that's the one right there. And this guy sold for, I think it was, was it 20 bucks. Yeah, $19.99 plus shipping on top for this. We bought the whole chest and it was in, it turned out it was in really bad condition, but we were able to sell all the parts from it. We've done really well on it. Back here on Two Echo, we sold a lot of, it's got like uh, sponges and stuff like that, I think. Let's see. At one point we had, I think about, I don't know what the heck that was. <laughs> At one point we had a bunch of lots of stuff like this. Uh, this might be like the last one that's going today. This sold for, let's see, $13.49 plus ship. And on six Foxtrot, down here at the bottom of this shelf, going to move these boxes. Here we go. Uh, some, somebody, the potter, Andrew the potter. I think this might be him right here painting this thing yeah this is it this uh fontanini piece sold for 13.99 plus ship you know for delta we sold a couple of uh i think they're going to be maybe at the bottom of this so i'm going to take it off the shelf sold a couple of hawaiian shirts here what are they called let me go look real quick they're called uh reverse print go barefoot okay I think that's going to be kind of at the bottom of this. What is that, sir? Members only. Got two members only jackets <laughs> in stock right now. Light blue, ready to ship. That's not it. Yellow floral robe. Uh -huh, here we go. Two medium go barefoot. These two shirts sold for $26.99 plus shipping on top. I'm going to get all this stuff back in here. Put it back on the shelf. This is about the amount of clothing we normally keep listed <laughs> that is in this bucket right here. I've had times where I've experimented with more, but I, I kind of like just keeping it to, to this. Sold some more Fontanini CC6. Here we go. Looking for Herschel. That is Herschel right here. This is the only one. Okay, good. Herschel sold for $17.99 plus shipping on top. I need to go up top here on 11A and pull three of these things down. Pull them blind. Those are uh, some Walgreens cane tips another one and then need one more sold three of these for here we go sold three of these for 9.99 a piece plus uh shipping on top i did go ahead and combine the shipping on all three of course and i had a couple of um ambassador by abu abu garcia had a couple of reels uh, that were broken. 
didn't work. Uh, this one doesn't spin at all when you spin the crank. It's also missing the knobs on the crank too. Sold this one for $22.99 plus ship parts only. Then on one Delta we sold, probably Charlie Delta. We sold these cool thermos. Uh, they're over here, I see them. These cool thermos bottles in this carrier. This is a really neat piece, I think. I, I love the colors and stuff on it. But anyway, they, they, these two thermos bottles come in this uh, carrying case. And we sold it for $30 plus shipping on top. On CC7, we sold this microphone. I did pack a few things. Put them in that IKEA bag already. Uh, this microphone sold for the amount shown on the screen. And I set up the step stool here because if we go up here to CC14, there are actually, this is over here for just a second. There are, this is actually a storage location underneath that box. So I'll get this down. We'll go take a look. Try not to fall. All right, here we go. Okay, inside of here are these cool old paper signs. I've already sold a couple of these. It's been a while, though. But we're looking for inflammable and dangerous. Oh, there's actually letters on them. Let's see. Inflammable B and dangerous C. Okay. So... Dangerous C, this is one of them. I think, yeah, this is uh, rail, these are old railroad placard things. Inflammable B. Oh, good, there is another one behind here. <laughs> Starting to think I didn't have the other one. I guess I could have shipped this one if I had to let the uh, customer know okay this is it right here all right inflammable will be and those sold for the amount shown on the screen all right back here on three bravo this is something else i listed yesterday another one of the now this one is older i think abu this one only says abu ambassador it doesn't say abu garcia so abu and garcia must have not met at that point also i didn't have any other model number information on here or anything i did have a serial number on the bottom and bottom of here but sold this reel for 29.99 plus ship sold it as parts only also uh it would sometimes reel in it doesn't it doesn't reel very smoothly probably needs new bearings and also the little uh line guy doesn't always move back and forth pocket 69 tell these are them right here sold a bunch of uh single barbie shoes i think they're just one shoe of each color or kind or whatever 809 plus shipping on top for these then in the cube we sold this little guy right here rolls royce silver ghost made of watch parts dials and gears and all that kind of stuff uh the only issue it did have it did have um Somebody used duct tape on the back to hold it together, but you can't tell anything from the front. And it does have the little hanger thing right there. That sold for 17, no, wrong, $14.99 plus ship. All right, went ahead and got, um, I had four box knife reorders or box resizer reorders. Need to go out, got those done. Those are ready to roll. All the other USPS stuff is ready to roll. Uh, now I'm going to pull some UPS stuff, UPS stuff, and one of them is actually this, and um, I brought all of these little dry boxes over to the garage sale uh, last weekend and sold like one maybe or two, <laughs> I don't remember, I gave a few away, uh, but Went ahead and bulk listed them all in bulk on eBay yesterday, and for I think like three fifty a piece or so, I, I came up with some number. I don't remember what it was, but thirty six of them for one hundred and thirty dollars 
plus shipping on top. I went ahead and pre-packed it. I thought it might sell pretty quick and it did. Um, cause these are like inside of here is, uh, two levels of six cartons each and each, each carton has three. So yeah, it was, it was a pretty easy pack. So I went ahead and sealed it up, put a thank you card in it and everything. Uh, so yeah, still made, I think we were into those for 50 cents a whack. So even sewing like that still made a really nice profit. And we have one more thing going out. Take me a few minutes to pack it. And we sold the, um, we sold the Ouija board from 1919. This guy, and uh, not in terrific condition, as you can see, but um, these are just pretty rare, really. There's not many on eBay that are this old that come up for sale. So, paid $2 for this guy, and got $199.99 plus shipping on top. It's gonna be a pretty easy pack, obviously. Uh, I have to make it super strong, though, but it's gonna be a flat pack. Okay, got my Ouija board packed, and um, <clears throat> basically, I just kept wrapping it in boxes until I felt good about the strength, and I do now. And I ended up using um, three of my Home Depot small boxes from right there, and it is strong. The boxes are probably stronger than, way stronger than the board, which is what I wanted. So, uh, yeah, pretty easy pack. So I'll go ahead and get that label printed. Then I got to go to UPS store. I've got these two and that that are going to go ups. Okay, I am back from, well, I went to I went to Goodwill and dropped a bunch of stuff off. I know a lot of people don't like Goodwill. I don't shop there anymore. I used to, though. Um, and I know a lot of people still do. So I hope they find some stuff they like out of that stuff. I'm good with it. I don't, like, I don't dwell too much on... Uh, you know, of Goodwills making this much money and this and that. I don't really care. They're convenient for me to drop the stuff off at. Um, and I've dropped my UPS stuff off, so I don't have any big boxes right here anymore. And we've cleared off so much room on these shelves. And then I did go over to my storage unit and picked out, just picked out a bunch of stuff. I got me a bag. I'll probably do this again tomorrow or the next day. But uh, yeah, <laughs> just so like a weird, wacky assortment of stuff I bought over the past couple years this is a uh, little cigarette machine so you put your you put, put your stuff in here or something and then you you do this and then it like spits oh uh, i think you hold your cigarette paper here thing your cigarette empty cigarette here and put the stuff in here and then do this and then it packs your cigarette into it or something so i have that i have this uh summer games the disc is in there. There's no manual. The box is here, but it's flat. Uh, this is for Commodore 64. I don't know what that's worth. I don't know what any of this stuff is worth, really. Robo Warrior for NES. And then I have a boxed game called Goal for NES also. I have a Wii Wheel. It's actually new in here. Well, might be new. I don't know. I don't even know if this is worth anything by itself. I have a pair of Magellan uh, shoes, hiking shoes. And I don't know, and like I said, I don't know if any of this stuff is worth anything. But we have this uh, Klingon bird of prey with flicker, flickering lights. Nintendo zapper, orange. Then we've got three of these. Uh, I did look these up to make sure I didn't want to just donate them. Uh, these three old printer cables from way back in the day. <laughs> they, these aren't that old though yeah, these are made in 06 to be sold at uh office depot these might be worth 10 bucks a piece or something and then uh oh these are good look i paid two dollars for these at a garage sale at some point uh sound master tdk sound master tapes uh professional master series these Oh look, the, at one point these sold for $4.49 for the 3-pack. This is probably worth about 20 bucks for the 3-pack. Let's see what else. Oh, I've got a uh, GameCube controller here. It's 
seems to be in pretty good condition. Need to just clean it up a little bit. I have an Xbox 360 controller here. Okay, and that is... Yeah, that'll clean up too. It's actually in really good condition. It has the red battery back on it too. And then I got a few more box games. That's a NCAA basketball for Super Nintendo and then Jeopardy. If those aren't worth much, then I'll, I can bundle them or something. And then I have this uh, Mewtwo Pokemon fig by Tomy. Don't, Oak Brook, Illinois. And I'm looking for a date on it is what I'm looking for. Okay, 2016 on that got a sealed beta tape and then we've got some kind of media here these look like small reel to reel reels reel to reel reels and so i'll probably just go ahead and sell these bundled together and then finally the last thing look at this sony jam box uh, i don't know if it's worth very much but man it's so clean and i love the graphics on the front of it look at those look at those awesome sony graphics on the front that is just a nice looking machine i'd be willing to bet the tapes don't work but uh i'll just sell it as is and hopefully the radio works oh there's a tape in here what tape is this Mannheim steamroller christmas in the air okay probably could test it with that and it does have the power cord to it so i'm gonna work on this stuff the rest of the day get it listed or um get it set to donate that's that's always a possibility too like if this or if this doesn't work might even just throw it away just depends so i'm gonna get to work on that and i am going to see y'all again very soon thanks a bunch for watching and i'll see y'all again next time bye y'all